Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you may be. My name's Ed, and welcome to Let's Go Fishing. We're here to collect kanji today. Um, we're at my favourite spot to do that. We're going after drummer tomorrow and um, and some luxury. We'll see what the conditions are like. It looks like there's a 1.5 metre swell at the moment. But um, I mean, that's still fishable, that's it's quite safe. I hope we do all right tomorrow. So um, I can show you how, how to put this bait on and also how to catch a, dr a drummer. Sorry guys, I forgot to mention the knife that I'm using. This knife here um, is a serrated edge knife and uh, I made this part on the back of it and it's just I just made a slit in it and I shaped an old butter knife to this shape here because um, that helps to take the uh, siphons out of the kanji and being serrated edge it doesn't blunt like a normal knife would the kanji is very tough and um, if you use it a couple of times just like a normal knife it will blunt so um, if you use a serrated edge knife it'll last for quite a while, a long time so that's a knife there Never turn your back to the sea. I know you might have heard that before, but it's true. Never do that. Because um, these waves will sneak up on you, and sometimes they just come in big sets, you know, and um, they'll, just, uh, they'll just knock you over. I mean, you don't have to be washed in to get hurt. I mean, land on barnacles or anything. Yeah, you'll get cut up. See that? That's no good for bait, so just rip that off. 
and like I said, this stuff down the bottom here is real soft. And it's hard to stay on the hook. All the pickers just rip it off anyway, so clean her up a bit. You can put that on the hook, but um, it is soft. Not as hard as this stuff here. Geez, the water is beautiful today. Yeah, about 23, 23 degrees. Make sure that sand out of them. Well, we should have enough for bait there. Beautiful afternoon. <laughs>